Following a report of molestation in Delta State, the Commissioner of Police, Hafiz Enua, is inviting anyone with useful information about the alleged molestation of four staff of a popular hotel in Efron. The victim and other females allegedly stripped forcefully by the employer once justice served, as their lawyer and civil rights activist says the perpetrators must be brought to book, irrespective of their status in their society. Iken Namiji reports. Earlier this week, the social media was awash with the story of four staff of this hotel in the front Uwe Council area of Delta State who were stripped for collecting tips from a guest. One of the victims tearfully narrates the story after being compelled to make a refund by means of deduction from her accounts. I was summoned to my, into my bros in my Shema's office in Kenneth Igbagi. It was like, uh, I should come and explain myself that a, tra a certain transaction happened on the 8th. I should come and explain myself. I told him that the only thing I could remember is one particular client that came that wasn't with his ATM card that he wanted to pay into our account and we obliged and he, at the end he gave us 20,000 tips, which we shared among ourselves between me, Gloria and Gift. And he said, as long as we are working for him, any tip that was being given to us belonged to the company. He collected my ATM card on gunpoint and ordered his account officer, Mr. Sources, to make a withdrawal of 5,000 from our account. He withdrew 161,000 from our account. We drew 111,000 from the account of Mr. Victor Ephraim and stripped us naked on gunpoint. They took us to Ebrumede police station and we stayed in the police station since on Friday on the 18th to on the 21st where he charged us to court. Answer to the alleged victims of the molestation expresses commitment to pursuing the matter until justice is served. This happens to be its usual practice. It highly pays salaries and in terms of human rights violation, you know, the punity is much. So, certainly, the victims will get justice. There's no doubt about that. No matter how big the person is, no matter how worthy he is, the law is above every person. And we will ensure God li we live in, and by the grace of God, that these four victims, they get justice. The Delta State Police Command will welcome useful information from the public concerning the matter. Anybody who has information that will aid in our investigation, such person or group of people are welcome. Nobody has right to strip anybody naked because doing so is an encroachment into the fundamental rights of others. Whether that incident occurred uh, as a result of what happened in that hotel or not, it is investigation that will prove that. The four staff of the hotel say they are undeterred in their quest for justice despite receiving threat messages in their phones. Ikenna Amich, CBC News, Efron, Delta State.